So just to begin this recording again, I've already mentioned a little bit before that today is December the 13th, Friday the 13th, 2019. So welcome everybody. I'm just going to lead everybody into a short meditation before I begin the, the channeling. So just close your eyes if you feel like it, or you can leave them open. And start to, whether with eyes closed or open, start to turn your attention inward and focus on your breath. Start to breathe in. And breathe out. And allow your breath to start to move, to smooth out. And as you feel your breath starts to smooth out, also try to start elongating them as well. Take your time to breathe in. And also take your time to breathe out. As your breath starts to become more regular and elongated, also start to relax your thought patterns as well. Allow your thinking to slow right down with your breath. And as you start to begin to slow your thinking, start to put your focus in your heart area. And just imagine that you are going down this elevator that takes you from top of your body where your head is. And just let this elevator take you right down to where your heart is. And as you focus on your heart, start to feel energy. Go to where your attention is. And allow your heart, the energy around your heart, to start to expand. Expand so that your energy feel almost as big as your body. And then allow it to reach out and connect with everyone that is in this room, and on this call right now, and also who would be listening to this recording whenever, wherever. Let's form this heart shape. This circle. Allow the circle to expand to be as big as the earth itself. The 
energy we can feel right now at this moment. It's a lot of excitement in the energy. A lot of anticipation. Your spirit guides and a third family is gathering around to participate in this channeling. So happy that you all decided to join me this evening. There is so much energy surrounding the earth right now. We are actually doing a lot running a lot of simulations, doing a lot of test runs for 2020, for the new energy. We want to make sure that we're able to allow just the right intensity of energies, the right mix of energies to come in so that we can support you energetically. Because 2020 is the beginning of a new cycle of experience on Earth for the whole galaxy, for the whole universe. And everyone, everywhere in the galaxy is preparing. No less on Earth than anywhere else. We are so excited. Especially for Earth too. Because for the first time, for a very long time, Earth is actually beginning to join the rest of the galaxy into moving forward. So even though these new energies is new for everyone, no matter where we are in the universe, on Earth though, you would feel it even more because We've been having new energies all along, but you've been cut off for a while. It may seem like just a blink of an eye from where we are standing, but for you, it had felt like a long, long time. It felt like you had been in darkness for a long, long time, for 10,000 years. And now that you are rejoining everyone else, you're going to feel this excitement, this coming new decade, 2020, so much more. And that's why we want to do whatever we can to support you and also make sure we don't overwhelm you. Because we you know how these energies, good as they may be, can sometimes overstimulate and maybe even blow a few circuits if we're not careful. So that's why we want to do so many simulations. We want to make all the preparations and have everyone ready 
to support you whenever you need us. What you can do now is stay in your heart. Search within your heart. That excitement. Focus on the excitement and know that whatever the new decade brings, it is all in service of humanity. A lot of changes are coming. They are good changes in the long run, but in the short run, they may feel intimidating. That's because we have been moving backwards for 10,000 years. All of a sudden, it's like your chains are broken and you can start to rejoin us, the rest of the universe, to start to go forward, to make real changes, not just baby steps, but actually big, gigantic steps. You may not feel it in the first year, maybe not right away, but as 2020 goes along, even by July, even though it's only been six or seven months into the new year, when you look back seven months from now, you would gasp in excitement. How much forward it is actually possible. So for now, just hold that excitement and embrace that excitement in your heart. And welcome that new energy in. Let that new energy completely align your body from the tip of your tailbone all the way up to the top of your head, your crown chakra. Let that new energy. Move up in gentle, slow, circular movement to clear out all the old energies, old beliefs, fear. Thinking that fear can actually protect you. Thinking that we can't make quick changes. We have to go step by step. Yes, you have to go step by step. But with every step that you take, the energy in 2020 will move you forward 10 times faster, further than it ever had before. So take that step, whatever it is, that one step represents for you to let go of the past. And let go of believing that you're just one person, you can't make changes and that is going to help everyone. You can. That's the only way. It's for just one person to take one step 
And if everyone on earth take one step, that is over 7 billion steps. That's a lot of steps. So do what? Think that one step, that one step that you can take is insignificant because it is not. You're one step. Times seven billion of many steps. Times all of the rest of the galaxy that is moving and behind you. It's going to multiply your efforts 10 times, a hundred times, maybe even a thousand times, seven billion. That's a very big step. So allow the energy to move its way and align your own energy so that you're no longer fighting yourself. You are at one with yourself. Your body is working with your mind. Your mind is working with your soul. Your soul is working with your higher self. Your higher self is working with the universe, all facing the direction of advancing the human collective, of advancing the universe. that activation that's aligning the whole body all throughout your body and allow this energy to clear out anything that you no longer want to support anymore. You, that energy, the same energy that goes through all your energy wheels, your chakras, is actually the same energy as circling the earth. It's the same energy that is creating the whole universe. We are all one wheel. Different aspects of one wheel of potential, of infinite source potential. Allow this oneness between you and the universe to gently inform you. What's the best direction for you? What it is that most resonate with your soul? For your soul to experience on earth. 
You had alignment with him. And allow us to assist you. To energetically help you clear out what does not support you anymore. and allow us to help connect you back to the organic matrix that is around Earth. And also in communication with all the other planets, stars, the universe so that we can feel each other's heartbeats without losing our own individuality. so that we can each take up the role that we're born to play in this universe. It's okay. Welcome in the changes, the activation of your DNA. They are right and proper and appropriate for this time. Because your DNA was meant to be activated. It was just waiting for these new energies to come in. It has been dormant for 10,000 years. Your DNA has been waiting for these energies to come in. And these energies will come in and wake you up at a cellular level. That's what I want you to do. Tap into abilities, innate abilities that you have forgotten. And they are part of you, part of your DNA, part of all the different species that has contributed their DNA to create your body. And you start to have different thoughts about what you want to eat, how much or how little you need to sleep, how much or how little you need to exercise. You will naturally feel that your body will have different demands on you. Your body 
body is here to work with you so that when your mind is ready to let go of anything, your body will be able to absorb enough energy to just to wash it out. Gone are the days when energy will get, just get stuck in your body. It's so sluggish. Not anymore. And this new energy, when your DNA is awakened, is actually much easier for you to transform energies that has been stuck or not working with your body. Trust your body. Trust the innate intelligence of your body. Work with it. And don't be alone. If new abilities start to come out, You may not feel it at first, but gradually you'll be able to pick up on how other people are actually feeling, thinking. You'll be able to communicate with friends and family without picking up a telephone without seeing them face to face, you'll be able to just telepathically connect with them. Tune into them and be able to get all the information that you need. And you'll be able to look at something, a book, or an idea. And be able to tap into the vibration of that idea of that book to see if it's worth spending your time. And even though you're an infinite being and you have all of eternity, But as a human experience, time is very precious. Your mind will start to be able to process this information so much faster than before. Because all your senses are heightened now. you'll be able to appreciate the feedback, the information that these heightened senses how much more information you can actually get by just trusting. Trusting your gut feel. Because your DNA is waking up. And these are just the beginning steps, the beginning years. So much more to come. And it all starts with loving your body creating that 
relationship with your body. It's not just self-care. It is also honoring that your body has an intelligence. And now that when your DNA is waking up, this intelligence is just going to get more and more powerful. Expect as the healing, even without taking any medication. If you would just take care of your body, the body would be able to heal itself. That has always been the case. It just has more access because the energy is supporting your DNA and it's creating a new pathway for your body to correct itself without relying on outside medication. So much more to come. But for now, just remember to work with your body. Talk to your body if you want an injury, pain to go away. And just talk to your body. Look at the part of your body that needs help and set the intention. Let your body know that you know it can heal itself. You don't need to know how it heals. You just have to let your body know this is where I need it help with. And trust that your body will do the best it can. And when your energy pathways are all aligned, truly aligned, even if your mind with your soul, you can feel anything. immune system will be much stronger. You may not even be able to get sick very often anymore. Because your body is transforming. Your DNA is transforming. And your innate ability is growing by leaps and bounds. So it's all to come. All to serve you. In this new playground. Breath. Rejoin the rest the universe. And bit by bit, we start to get all the upgrades that the rest of the universe has been enjoying for the last 10,000 years. It's a lot of catching up.
that is all good. Can you feel your heart right now? Can you feel your heart pulsating? With the rest of creation. We are all one. And when we all synchronize as one, we move forward. We are power to be reckoned with. We are the creator of this universe. Each and every one of us. We are a different aspect of this creator. This is all we want you to remember. Remember who you are. And remember what it feels like. To be pulsating as one. The others. Remember what this feels like. To be one with the universe. the individual as well as the whole at the same time. Just balance the two. That is what they call to be. Unique and whole, part of the one at the same time. To peace in your individuality. Don't be too selfish to hold on to that individuality, like you lose sight. Are for one. Both are true. I go up as duality. And be just the fulcrum. We both exist at the same time. So much because we are you. You are us.
This is the message to remember. Imagine all this energy that we're feeling now. Now the energy of the whole universe is beginning to start to condense. All the way back to the designs of your heart. When you're ready, take a deep breath. And open your eyes when you are ready. Mm-hmm.